Hello, this is Winker Reviews, and today I'll be doing a video on Little Joe about a woman who is a plant breeder and is in denial that her plant may or may not be responsible for the onset of dementia, while her co-workers urge her to get rid of the plant. I have very mixed feelings about this movie. On one hand, I liked it a lot. On another hand, I thought it was kind of boring at times. It's not a slow movie, but it is very calm and dry. It's one of those movies where you would benefit more listening to the dialogue because not much is really happening on screen. It's really, for the most part, just characters talking to each other. It's one of those movies where you really have to sit and pay attention. You can't, like, look down at your phone or or really do anything. You have to give this movie your full attention in order to enjoy it as much as you can. I thought the movie itself was very beautiful to look at. It's very visually stimulating, and there are even times where the characters are wearing clothing that matches the background. The color palette is stunning. It's a very beautifully shot movie. As for the movie itself, I thought it started off very promising and a little creepy because you really didn't know what to expect. And then towards the middle, it started to slow down a lot. And I actually started losing interest because not much was happening and it was a little bit repetitive at times. And when I say repetitive, again, this movie really depends on dialogue because not there's really no action in this movie. And some of the dialogue and some of the character interactions are a bit repetitive. But then it starts to pick up again during the last third. But I thought the ending was a little weak. The movie just feels like one big build-up, like it feels like it's going to build up to something. And when the climax finally comes, it doesn't really lead to much. I mean, it leads to something. It does have a beginning, middle, and end, but I just was expecting a little more. Like, I wanted an oomph, if you know what I mean. And I'm not talking about, like, a big Hollywood ending. I don't need a stereotype. Like, I don't need explosions or something that's action-packed. I just wanted something a little more interesting to happen. Towards the end, it did start to give me, not even towards the end, but towards the middle all the way to the end, I got like a Rosemary's Baby kind of vibe. Even though there's no cult or devil worshipping per se, it is very similar in my opinion. And I did kind of like that. Anyway, I didn't dislike the movie, I just wanted more. It didn't have that it factor that I was really rooting for it to have. And for that, I give it like a 5 out of 10. I think it's beautifully shot, like I said before. And I do think it's worth watching when, you, when you're bored and you have nothing else to do. So yes, 5 out of 10.